now we are visiting to the war memorial museum and it's near to district one maybe like five ten minutes by grab and the parking fees is three thousand uh, vietnam dong and the uh, entry to the open area is free so you can take all the photos and videos with this magnificent tanks and planes so let's see Uh, now you can see the biggest tank here and this tank can fire up to 32 kilometers. You can see the blue 82 seismic bomb and this can hold up to like 5000 kilograms of explosive and it was used in 1970 in Vietnam. And this made a really serious damage of up to 3 kilometers. image is behind me may be a little disturbing because all you can see you know what war brings to a country uh, it's a really tragic and sad full event because a lot of pregnant women old people young ba babies were died so I hope war brings to a better place The war usually gets over after a few years, but the consequences of the war you can see in pictures and it's really emotional to be honest. And I don't have any words to you know tell the sad stories behind all these photos. Uh, behind me you can see some colorful paintings by children, but it actually tells the really sad stories about all the after effects of the chemicals used in the war. Well, I'm not here to judge any country or any person, but I do hope nobody in their life can, you know, go through such traumatic events. And I really hope world lies in a, you know. Uh, actually, I was really happy coming to this place because, you know, it gives you a real idea what a war can bring to a com country. And this all tanks, all the big machines, has a sad story behind it. Uh, hello, welcome to. Ho Chi Minh City and today I'm visiting to Notre Dame Cathedral. You see? The name is I think inspired from the Notre Dame Cathedral in Paris, where I visited like two years back and it looks not exactly the same but yeah.